Hi guys, I've started um, this video so I can explain an article that uh, a teammate of mine, James uh, Draskus, known as um, uh, Young Pro in the overclocking scene, uh, did. He did a blog article about how to could change speeds during benchmarks uh, with a little tool that he's created um, called um, a hotkey control tool. So what it essentially does is controls the frequencies in the uh, Gigabyte GTL software. Uh, so what you have to do is, he's got instructions, you have to download the GTL control exe and the ini file, uh, which is what I've done here. There they are. And then, oops, let me just change something here. Um, I'll exit this. And then you have to basically install the tweaker, which is this program, lovely program here. Uh, and then he's basically said that once you go to edit this uh, uh, ini file, so right click on it, uh, edit file, you'll get these options here which you can basically tweak yourself. Um, so <coughs> essentially what, what this does is allows you to create four hot hotkeys that are F1, F2, F3 and F4. Every hotkey has the ability to change multiplier, B clock, and voltage. And for the sake of this first exercise, I'm going to um, basically change the first two profiles and enable all the options and show you how they change. Uh, so basically, I'll save this change and then make sure you don't have this GTO control running in your task. So you uh, don't have it running. So basically, I'll just double click on it. So I've got it running now. So essentially, now that it's running and this is uh, and this is saved, I should be able to say press uh, F2, which is what I'm doing now. F2. So I've hit F2 and I've gotten 42 times 102 B clock with 1.4 volts. Okay. So that is F2 is basically a hotkey for the second ratio, which I've changed here. Now the first one is 40 multiplier. 100.5 B clock and 1.25. So if I hit F1, see it instantaneously. As soon as I hit it, instantaneously goes back to those settings. You can see it's changed the voltage, it's changed the ratio, it's changed the B clock. So if you wanted to, uh, so let's go back to two and change this to zero. Save. You have to make sure that's not running anymore. So you exit and you just reload it. There you go. And you hit F1 now. We've basically disabled the voltage change on the first ratio. So essentially, voltage has changed everything else. So you've changed the B clock and the multiplier, but it's left the voltage from whatever it was set before that. So in this case, we've had the F2 loaded, and it's basically just uh, kept that voltage, but it's changed the ratio and the uh, uh, B clock. Uh, very handy tool. Big, uh, you know. Uh, big thanks to uh, Young Pro for making this tool public, and I'm sure it'll help a lot of people since GTL hotkey function is not working uh, uh, yet, or it hasn't been implemented yet. Um, so, anyway, um, good luck and uh, have a crack at this tool. I reckon it's really good.